Hi there, this is Aaron from Undoubt Studio coming back with another video on connecting your Facebook Ads pixel to your website and this particular video will be useful if you are a service-based business or a business that regularly collects leads and collect forms from your website visitors, alright? So if you take a look at this page, I will be quickly guiding you on setting up your pixel for a new page, a new landing page, a lead magnet, or anything similar to that. And as you can see, I have an exclusive guide on getting leads and sales using Facebook ads. It's a free ebook. You can also go ahead and download it for free. And you can just sign up and get a copy, alright? And generally, I will be using this free ebook as a lead magnet to actually get leads from Facebook ads to my website, alright? In this video, I will be showing you how to actually set up manual pixel events so each time when someone types in their, e their name, their email address, and when they hit on send me a copy, Facebook will register that as a lead, alright? So I will go back to the events manager and if you don't know how to access that, well, it's in the old tools and it's in the events manager, all right? And first thing I will do is to go to add events and add from pixel, all right? So basically this will be a manual pixel setup and I will open event setup too. So what I will be doing is going to this website. I'm going to copy this. I'm going to paste this and just hit on open website might take some time to load all right so once it loads you need to give it a second so the facebook event setup tool will actually appear all right so the first thing i'm going to do is actually go ahead and you you are able to check what kind of events are registered in your website so as you can see um all of this all of this is a view content um, action all right so let's say you know if you if this is a new landing page and your Facebook pixel doesn't actually track this as a lead so what you can actually do using the event setup tool is actually track buttons or track your URL all right so so basically you can actually track this URL this um, exact page so each time someone comes into this page you are able to um, select it as a view content all right but as you can see I have already um, inserted a view content tracking so I just want to show you that you are able to track the URL using the Facebook event setup tool so each time you run ads and you send someone to this page this ex your exact URL, you're able to um, tell Facebook that this is a view content and you are able to retarget them in your retargeting campaigns. So other than that, I will also be setting up um, this button. So each time when someone signs up, Facebook will actually register that as a lead. All right. So I will just go ahead and click on track new button. And click on this button and select lead all right so as you can see it has been successfully set up so what this does is that each time someone actually signs up to download my free ebook Facebook will actually register that as a lead and if you are running a lead based campaign you want Facebook to actually optimize for people that will actually sign up and download the ebook, all right? So that way, when you, you start to run your Facebook ads, Facebook will provide you with valuable data and analytics on how much it costs to get a lead and how much leads are you getting from your Facebook ads. That way, you are able to scale your Facebook ads, all right? So as you can see, in this landing page, I don't only have one sign up form, but I also have another sign up form at the bottom. So I will also 
track this as a lead sign up and I don't want to include the value because basically it is a free free ebook but if you know if your ebook does cost some kind of money things like this then you can actually choose a value on your page so you want to actually have the pricing there so that way you are able to go ahead and click on that pricing right but for this form for this ebook and this lead magnet there is no price and it's free for download so I will just be selecting don't include value and this is a lead I will select on confirm and that way as you can see Facebook will register um, a lead each time someone signs up to this form or this form so basically this is it and I will finish set up and basically this is it on manually setting up your Facebook pixel onto your landing page or your lead magnet so each time when someone signs up you are able to track leads and you are able to get data into your Facebook ads dashboard all right so thank you for watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my other videos if you are someone that is growing your business through Facebook ads so I will see you soon